Hey everybody, 2074 Comics giving you another toy review. And today we are reviewing DC's Multiverse, Green Lantern, Kyle Reiner, Atrocious Build-A-Figure. And my dudes, this figure looks awesome and I can't wait to crack this bad boy up. And so let's do this quickly. This is the front of the package, uh, the side where it says Green Lantern, Kyle Reiner and the back of this cool looking package with atrocious and the build a figure pieces that you need and all the figures on the bottom which you should collect to build this awesome figure and the other side where it says green lanterns Kyle reiner blackest night which we shouldn't forget that that's what the series is called and my dudes the front of the package one more time and oh he looks so awesome so let's crack this bad boy open and there's Kyle Reiner out of the package and he looks awesome my dudes look how cool he looks I'm loving that mask that iconic Kyle Reiner mask and look at that ring wow he looks so good McFarlane knocked us out of the park once again and I, okay I am a, uh, there's two things I'm a little disappointed with with this figure other than that this is such a cool figure uh, I really wish they, that he had his iconic uh, Kyle Reiner suit like if this is a cool one don't get me wrong but I really wish that he had the original uh, you know the one that he always wears and the fact that the color is a little off like I like this color a little bit better than the emerald green that we normally get but he's gonna look kind of weird beside our other uh, Green Lantern figs right because uh, he's more of a light green almost like a lime grassy green where the other ones are like more of an emerald green but uh, we'll take a look at uh, John Stewart later on, so I'll let you guys take a peek at what I'm talking about. All right, so this is the front of the figure, the side of Kyle Reiner, the back, the other side, and the front once again. And like I said, this is a cool figure. He looks awesome. Other than the color and maybe the suit, I have no other complaints about this because he does look cool. Like, let's take a look. Okay, this is John Stewart, which you can totally see that he's more of an emerald green like a darker green and our buddy Kyle Reiner here is more of a lighter green like a lime green type thing but like I said he's a still a cool looking figure and I'm glad I picked him up because I want McFarland to start making more of these green lanterns because I'm in line I'm in line to pick up these bad boys okay so let's see what Kyle Reiner comes with let's put these guys to the side all right Kyle Reiner also comes with the chest piece of the atrocious Build-A-Figure. Uh, he comes with a lantern and uh, a Green Lantern sword. I've never really seen Kyle Reiner with a sword, but hey, it looks cool. I'll take it. And also, let's not forget, he comes with the McFarlane iconic base and the cool card with Kyle Reiner like see this looks exactly like the fig I, I see where he was coming from but I really wish it was more of his iconic you know suit and the color was a little bit more of an emerald green but other than that this figure is awesome my dudes I suggest you pick this up that's up to you you know uh, uh, let me know uh, put your comments on the bottom are you to pick this up will you pick this up I think you should because if you're a Green Lantern fanatic like myself uh, you'd want this figure even though he has a different shade of green than the others he still will look cool beside your other Green Lantern figures and once you build that atrocious figure you won't won't regret it I'm telling you but hey like we say thanks for watching